What's up guys, it's Sam, welcome back to another Clash of Clans video. So today, we're going to be going over the war that my clan just lost. Unfortunately, we lost it. We were, there's a few contributing factors. First of all, a bunch of people decided to leave at the beginning. Don't know why, don't know how, don't know the reasons, but that's beside the point. So let's rearm our traps, collect some Dark Elixir, uh, reload our Expos, and look at what happened. So this war, we kind of, we didn't, comp yeah, it was pretty bad of a loss but luckily since loot is so high for even for beating a base i still got and even though we lost i still got 212,000 of each and almost a thousand dark elixir so not still not horrible so i'm gonna first find my uh war attacks somewhere down here uh here we go so well uh there was a guy one starred i just wanted to finish it off this was kind of cheap but it was really fun so, Lure the Dragon out. I'm kind of proud. This was like a very, very, I guess you could say peaceful. It was very well thought out, like planned out. So, anyways, put down a few archers, put down a few, uh, some of my minions. And I was hoping that they would be able to do the job, but they didn't. He only got down to about half health. And, yeah, so then I put down my queen, and he started, uh, he started to spew fire at her, but... I put up her ability. There's actually a really funny thing here. So, didn't want. Uh, so then I put down all of my balloons. Did I, even though I had a lava hound, I just decided not to. I don't know why. I just forgot about it. So I put down my rages. Not a bad place at all. Right into the, they bring them right into the center. And then I also have my two heals. I don't even know if I use. No, I use the yeah, there. I use them on the left side. It was definitely more helpful. I realized that I hadn't used my lava hound, so I put him in just to distract him or her. I wonder that. So. If you guys think the Lava Hound's a him or a her, tell me. I guess it's a her because it makes pups, but it's debatable. Anyways, look, over here you can see my queen's still alive. She she has low health, but she's still alive, so it it's okay. Uh, and anyways, I have a bunch of balloons left. Uh, my, uh, what's I'm gonna call it? Just, uh, my Lava Hound just exploded, and I have some witches in my clan castle, and it's all going pretty well, so 60%. The next one I'll show you was a clutch it was like it was the definition of a clutch raid so anyways uh that was at 78 percent and let's just speed this up there really isn't much else so i had just like a wave of people and the king was still hammering away at a few people but anyway i had those last two buildings left and then it went down uh, i'll show you my next one probably the most heroic defense and attack. Oh, my first raid's probably way down. Here we go. Two star on, like, uh, yeah, he was a really, he was only like number 18. I wasn't very good at this. So, put, put him, put my Lava Hound down. And then I think I took a little bit too long. Also, he had a level 4 dragon on his clan castle. And he had air, uh, skeleton traps. So, I wasn't prepared for this. I didn't put down my main. I didn't lure them out nearly as well as he did in that second raid. I don't know. I think I just went a little gung ho in this in this first attack. I was gonna say second, but it was actually the first. So can't tell where my second lava hand is, but I think it died very quickly as well. But my dra that dragon is still at almost full health, and I've lost all my minions. And I'm just uh, fearing for my, actually no, I have, I have my clan castle a few minions and I'm just fearing for my life even because I have my heroes, I might be able to use them, but that's it. Anyways, I've, I got, just got the game Far Cry 4, it's a really fun game. My friends have been telling me to get it for so long and I finally got it, so I'm pretty happy about that. Anyways, so there's a, dra so there, his dragon's at like half health and I have level 2 dragon, but hopefully... I'll get just close enough and I'll be able to kill it. So I actually managed to with just a little bit of life left, but then that dragon immediately went down from that archer queen. Then I said, oh, what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? Put down my queen, starts going to a wall, of course. That's her favorite target. It literally should say that. I, I If it ever says that as a joke one day, I will just like die of laughter. So then she, then she just passes there, goes to that. And then she goes to the town hall, which I was so hoping she would. She's go and then use her ability because I want her to 
stay safe and I I don't want her to die because I am I'm like freaking out. I'm like I need to get at least one star or else I'm just I need to shame myself. So I luckily the king is being stupid and because he can't be lowered out, thank you Supercell for putting that in. He um oh and she goes that way. So anyways, I finally got the one star and I put down my king immediately used his ability because I want him to have a bit of a meat shield. So we're at 48% and 49 and the queen gets the 50 percent and then i ended it right there that was crazy clutch i did so many things wrong with that like i should have uh put i should have put my balloons in sooner i probably should have put both my lava hounds in probably should have done spells better learn how to climb castle but that's for another day i guess so uh let's go down so first let's see the most heroic defense by Matt uh, nothing but boom actually he's the youtuber he's another youtuber in the clan anyways I basically the, when they say most heroic they literally mean most clutch which is probably just a better name for it I don't know why they don't call it that but they don't uh, yeah again sorry for uploading a bit late it is a bit late right now just because I was playing Far Cry 4 and just kind of chilling but so yeah, trying to lower the clan castle, that was smart of them, but when you see someone with 27 wizards, they're probably not going to win, they're probably thinking too much of themselves. Anyways, let's just look into the corner, <laughs> the weird looking uh, skeleton trap. But anyways, so yeah, you're trying to lure them out too much, you're wasting your wizards, you're wasting your archers, and that really didn't do much, you need to do some splash damage, and there you go. But now you only have 15 wizards, you've lost some of your attacking force, you don't have wall breakers, so you're going to have trouble getting through the first layer, and yeah, uh, rage was good, but of course they're all in one area, so a few good mortar shots and they're all dead, because you didn't actually, you used, to see where they use that heal, or where, when I say you, I mean balas, balas, alright, so yeah. And you have a few wizards left, you have a few giants left, and hopefully you're you're just he's just hoping that he can get that those stars, but then there's hidden Tesla pops up. Uh forty four percent he probably knew he was gonna lose here because all those defenses are hammering away at those like three giants and it goes down. So nice defense, Matt. Uh I mean not a bad base, maybe actually put your put your Teslas in. I think Tesla's inside the walls make it that much better. So, Sensuna. Um, let's see your most heroic attacks. So, you did 29 uh, Hog Riders. So, you learned the Clan Castle. Good idea. But then, you probably didn't actually bring any wizards or anything. Oh, but I don't know. You brought a lightning spell. So, not a horrible idea. But those wizards are still alive with a bit of health. And there's also a skeleton trap. Then you put them all in, which probably wasn't the best idea. Maybe put down your clan castle, but uh, you have heals, uh, and yeah, let's just see how this plays out. I actually don't remember how this raid went. So then you put down your your dragons, your heroes, and you put down a heal spell way too late, I think, because you only had like a f half of your attacking force for when you initially put them in. I would put a heal spell down, not immediately, but almost immediately, because that'll really make a difference. So, anyways, you do have dragons attacking the town hall, which is definitely good. It was, this was also a very similar clutch rate. I think mine could have been the most heroic attack, but unfortunately it wasn't. But, luckily that town hall is, gets the two star right after they those wizards and clan castle and stuff on the corner get the first 50%. So, let's let's see how this plays out. Oh, did you actually get a 3 star on this? I mean, I doubt it, but I'm actually not sure. So, no, you never got a 3 star, but impressive raid nonetheless. Nice job. I don't exactly see how this was the most heroic, but good job. Hopefully, hopefully in the next clan war we get a better turnout and yeah, that's pretty much it. Maybe you can just look at my log right now, though. I've had some pretty great raids, like right here. I've had I got two. I got almost six. I got pretty much six hundred thousand in resources. I've been finding some good raids, and 
Yeah, I, I've been reading a lot. I really need to read more, but let's just look at this one while I just talk, saying, whoa, there's actually more resources than I thought. There's uh, 356,000. Oh, if only I had gotten all of it. But anyways, that's beside the point. So I hope you guys are happy that I'm back. Uh, I have been working on... I'm, I'm trying to learn Photoshop better because I'm horrible at it, but I made this nice background i'm gonna learn how to make nice text like make it shiny looking and hopefully when you see it tomorrow or the next day probably by like wednesday then you'll be the channel will be a new it'll be nice it'll be just ready for some new stuff so yeah i'm you i hope you enjoyed that raid uh, i guess i probably missed like no i just missed the storages and I still got a good amount of loot I was very happy with the, that raid and didn't I don't even yeah I didn't even use all my troops don't like to use all my troops because then I have to wait that much longer f to train them so that's it for now so I hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you're excited for more stuff hope you guys are excited for the next update coming out in this game in Boom Beach and, of course, the global release of World's Domination, I'll keep mentioning that until it comes out, because I just can't wait. Also, my elixir defenses are almost at max. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one.